Motorola's Moto X is one of the latest in the Android line of smartphones, and they're doing things differently than a lot of the other devices out there. Simple, elegant, just beautiful touches. I'm Joe Levi for Pocket Now. This is how you can get Moto X style active notifications on your Android device today. According to the developer, this app will run on Android 4.0 ice cream sandwich devices and above, although it's specifically made for Nexus-style devices and is tested with Android 4.3 and CyanogenMod 10.2. Immediately after you've installed the app, you'll have to allow notification access. Hit OK and then tap on the check mark next to Dynamic Notifications. Launch the app and you'll be able to go in and set whether you want dynamic notifications on or off. You'll even be able to fire a test notification if you want. If there are some apps that you don't want to be displayed, you can set them up in your block list. Simply select which ones you want to uh, not appear and they won't. The default is to allow everything. If you want to see the screen a little bit longer, you can set a custom screen timeout. Simply come in here and set the time to whatever you want. We'll accept the default. If you do set a custom timeout, you'll need to add administrator access to the app. After you've seen your notification, you can choose to turn the screen off after you dismiss it. It's a good idea to save batteries. Those are the basic features of the app. Premium features require unlocking and that requires an in-app purchase of 99 cents. Doing so is relatively easy. In my case, it's protected by a password. Confirm the purchase, wait for a minute, and the payment is successful. Just as easy as that. You're taken back to the app, then you have all of these other options that you can use. You can use this as the lock screen. You can auto-wake if you want to. Night mode. Night mode's kind of interesting. You can set this so it doesn't show the, uh, the notifications in the middle of the night and potentially wake you up. So that could be a good thing. You can also set custom brightness if you want to dim the screen or make it a little bit brighter. Let's go ahead and send a test notification to the device. You can see very, very simple and clean. I've got the time, I've got my latest notification, and you can see that this is a Gmail type notification. It's really not. The, the developer sends you over to rate their app, which you can do. I mean, that's easy enough. This is what a normal email notification looks like. Very clean, very simple, elegant. It shows you what you need to know and nothing more. The app is called Dynamic Notifications by Great Byte Software. It's available for free today in the Play Store, but if you want to see some of the features that we showed off here, you'll need to buy the in-app upgrade to the, uh, the Plus or the Pro version. It's about 99 cents for that. Thanks very much for watching. If you liked what you saw, please give the video a thumbs up to let us know that you liked it. Why not share it with your friends on all your favorite social media, and of course, subscribe to our video channel so you don't miss out on anything cool. For Pocket Now, I'm Joe Levi. We'll catch you next time.